Yeah, yeah, what's the deal, people? This Vinny Paz, the Pazmanian Devil, Jedi Mind Tricks, all the way from Philadelphia. You know what I'm saying? You're watching Represent TV, the rawest hip hop show in Europe. You know what I'm saying? Stay tuned. Yeah. Also, Splash 2005 immer noch. Heute haben wir Sonntag, den letzten Tag. Es hat verdammt nochmal viel, viel geregnet. Der ganze Zeltplatz steht ganz komplett unter Wasser. Überall Motter. Aber die Leute lassen sich nicht die gute Laune nehmen. Hier gerade live on stage waren Jada Mind Tricks aus den Vereinigten Staaten. Wir freuen uns, die Jungs jetzt hier zu haben. Um, welcome to Germany and welcome uh, to Splash Festival 2005, of course. Thank you for being here. Um, uh, how did you uh, like the show so far? Did you did, uh, could you catch any vibes or anything so far? Yeah, man, it's beautiful out here. Um, there's more appreciation for hip hop in Europe than in the States, you know, because we're kind of spoiled because that's where it started, you know. So there's more pre appreciation from the fans out here. They have more knowledge of the culture. Um, I often have. Um What, what I hear often from, from guests from the United States when they perform over here, they say uh, that um, people uh, seem to be more loyal, just, just loyal because if they like a track, uh, they try to uh, search for other tracks from the same guys and, and so on. Um, what do you think is, is um, an artist supposed to deliver to the fans in order to motivate them to do that? I mean, I, I guess it's with anything in life. You just have to make quality, quality product. You know, if you you make something good, you have to continue to, uh, you know, continue to make that same level and get better with each thing, so that the loyalty stays there. You know what I mean? Um, consistency is a big problem in hip hop, in music in general. You know, people make one one dope record and then they fall off. So. I guess the objective is to continue to make quality music, you know, to keep those fans loyal and keep them coming back and we can keep coming here, you know, and rocking. Um, Jira Mind Tricks, the group uh, with a pretty long history and um, it, it um, um, underwent uh, quite a couple of changes also concerning um, the members of the group. What happened? Could you give us a slight overview? Yeah, well, basically, it's the group has kind of always been me and Stoop. Me on the rhyme, Stoop as the producer, you know? It's always kind of been like that. Um, we met in uh, 1992, so we've been together for like 13 years. Uh, Violent by Design, my man Jas Allah was on that. Um, we were, he was in the group before that, but uh, he ended up going away to college, so me and Stoop did the first record alone. Then the second record we did with Just. Then by the time Visions of Gandhi came around, we had Split. Um, you know, so it's there's always a rotation of people involved with the projects, but at the core of the create the creative core has always been me and Stu. You know, so in the fans' eyes, it might have changed or not changed, but it's always been me and Stu. You know, to us, that's been the core of it. Uh, what what role do the guys play that are on the grind with you right now? Uh, they play a huge role. Uh, they're the reason I'm here. Crip from outer space. Uh, Drew Drew Dollars is our DJ. You know he's in the group. You know that's our DJ. Des Devious uh, was on Legacy of Blood. We're working on his solo record. We're a family, man. It's not. It's beyond music with us. You know what I mean? We we keep each other level-headed and uh, help each other every way, whether it's in life, music, creatively, we're brothers, so, uh, you know, they keep me level-headed when I'm acting crazy sometimes. <laughs>